except one grow up. They always know they will grow up. And the way Wendy knew was this. One day when she was 10 years old, she was playing in a garden and she plucked another flower and ran with it to her mother. She must have looked rather delightful for her mother, Mrs. Darling, put her hand to her heart and cried. Oh, why can't you remain like this forever? That was all that had passed between them on the subject. But henceforth, Wendy knew she must grow up. You always know after you're ten. Ten is the beginning of the end. We've lost a ton of money, haven't we?
all money or someone else. Shit. <coughs> Mr. Darling would boast to Wendy that her mother not only loved him, but respected him. He was one of those deep ones who know about stocks and shares. Of course, nobody really knows, but he quite seemed to know and would often say, stocks were up and shares were down in a way that would have made any woman respect him. I'm pregnant. <laughs> Three times. Wendy came first, then John, and then Michael. And of course, they kept Nana the maid. Get the fuck out of my room! Jeez! I just wanted to... Whatever it was, don't! His iPod. Wendy. Yeah? I've got this great idea for a song. Show me then. I'll sing it for you. writing a song. supposed to sound. Nana. Like you have been smoking two packs a day? <coughs> Try rhubarb leaf. Works every time for... Don't you have soccer practice? 
practice today. Oh, yeah. Sounds like a sick god, blatant. Huh. All right. Is it, dinner is getting ready. Uh, aren't you going out tonight? Yeah. Oh, thank you, Vindy. I almost forgot. Is your dad home yet? No, but... He's now. Children, my seat, children. Uh, and Nana? Uh, 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 shall we continue? Yes, uh, come continue on. Continue what? Uh, John was just showing me the latest. Come, Papa. Yes, I'll come, show Papa, you. Yes. Uh, no. uh, come, come, see. <laughs> now that wasn't too bad, was it? Not children. Of course not. Of course, my darling. Oh, the gaiety of those romps. And the gayest of all was Mrs. Darling, who would pirouette so widely that all you could see of her was her kiss. And then if you had dashed at her, you might have got it. There never was a simpler, happier family until the coming of Peter Pan. Thank you. 
Wasn't it the story for a boy who could fly? Oh, Peter Pan can fly. He is the place for never lunch. Mom, isn't that the place where Michael Jackson lives? Mm. John P. Oops. He used to live. Oh dear, it's awfully late to go. Yeah, ma'am, you're right. I gotta go. Don't worry and don't wait up, okay? Bye. Bye. But oh dear. Bye, mom. Hey, you! This is none of your business. Bendy? Hey, what's this? I do believe it's that Peter again. Whatever do you mean, Doc? That's for me to know and for you to find out. But, ooh, I think I'll go lie down again. I feel a dream coming on. Good night, Mom. How are you? Good, good, you? Ah, oh, I'm fine. So, there's Peter. Really? Late again. So today's song? You're practicing? Yeah, we hi guys. Hey, hey, hi. 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 What's up, how are you? How are you? Hi, we're fine. So we have a song to practice. Who? Which, which, which? Who is the Yeah, Kaiser. Ready? All right, so. Okay.
Judy in front of the courthouse. Judy is carrying the cards with three. Child enjoy, not child destroy. Protect their present. Give them a future. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. you think we're ready? No! no. But anyway, how many? About 50. Tomorrow night. Morning. At the black hat. It's all set. Yes, we are going to do it. We are going to rock them. Yeah, yeah. We have to touch their hearts with these posters. I don't know. With something powerful, with something that will make them see children are real people with real feelings. The statistics are staggering. Did you know that 90% of the abuse happens in the home from family members who they're supposed to trust? Yeah, like an uncle, a cousin, an elder brother. Yeah. Here, check this out. Leave them alone! Leave them alone! Get your dirty fucking hands off! Leave them! Ladies, what have we here? And what are you doing with? Child yes. prostitution is an old, global and complex phenomenon which deprives children of their childhood, human rights and dignity. Child prostitution can be seen as a commercial sexual exploitation of children involving an element of forced labor. Thus, can be considered as contemporary form of slavery. Globally, child prostitution is reportedly to be a common problem in Central, South America and Asia. So, what is this? This is our call. We are part of SCAN. Stop child abuse now. It's a direct action group and we are... And where are you going to directly act? <laughs> and when and how many okay. and... Hey! You... Oh. So, Guys, should we take it again? Yeah, we have yeah, all right then, two, so, from bridge. How was it, teacher? Yeah, yeah. So one, two, three, just counting, and then start. All right, yeah. Have you seen a girl come in here? No. 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 Nobody is there. I'm asking again. Have you seen a girl come in here? No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. I wish. There's nobody here. It's just no. us. No. No. <laughs> Thank you. Nice job, sir. Bye. Yeah. Hi. Thanks. Oh, I think. Um, do you think? Who, <laughs> me? Uh, no, not really. I mean, not at all. Actually, I was She just, just dropped in. <laughs> paying us a visit, weren't you? <laughs> nice legs. And what's your name, nice legs? My name is Wendy. Wendy? Wendy? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, Wendy. I am Peter Pan, and these are the Lost Boys. Yes. Oh, oh my God! I'm a big fan of yours. I love you. Really? Yeah. Oh my goodness. My goodness. I think. Are you staying or leaving? Oh, I have to go actually. I was with a friend. We got hassled by the cop. I hope she's okay. Why hassle? We are putting on a demonstration Saturday at the 
court house against child abuse so this cop started getting really aggressive and we ran good cause we know something about that shit oh thanks wish you had been here 10 years ago our group is called scan stop child abuse now i found that a good kick to the groin is always effective against inquisitive uncles <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right yeah i bet we all got stories to say about being knocked around as kids but now we have some work to do yeah. don't we uh, ha yeah. Yeah. yeah 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 but if you have some stories maybe you'd like to share uh, yeah not any that i would like to publish thank you uh, no but maybe to it's in the past sweetheart I am a big boy now, and our group has some music and some money to make. With enough money, no one can ever touch me again. Yeah, sure. You are very popular. You have got lot of fans who look up to you, adore you. Indeed, we do. Yeah. But maybe that's not enough. Maybe you have to think about those who are still suffering, the little ones who can't fight back. Get me a crying towel. <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, Wendy. There are a lot of good causes in the world, and everybody is hustling us to write a song and make a contribution. You don't know how many times. Okay, we... sorry, I bothered you. Go ahead, keep singing, keep making money, and all of you keep thinking that as long as you have enough money, you are protected. Ha! What an illusion, man. What? I am the king of illusion. Don't you know I can fly? Yes, and you can never grow up either. Really? I'm sorry. It's really not. What? Responsible? Mm, not like that. Neither am I. We just got this deadline for the next one. So you can't one. be bothered, right? We really like to help you. Oh, really? Yeah, sure. Look, all the boys have horror stories about being abused, neglected. That's why we are the lost boys. We've all been on the street, run away mostly. And Peter, well, he held us. He gave us something to be proud of, and we have a new life because of him. And the other stuff is, it's not something that easy to talk about. This you know. Yeah, sure, I know. Hey, fly. Yeah. We need you here. Ah, uh, just uh, let me talk to the guys. Maybe there's something we can do. We are going to be at the court house Saturday morning. Taking the message to the people. Scan. Scan. Right. Yeah. right. Uh, and thank you. And good luck. Thanks. Where were you, man? I'm just. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> so can we hear? Yeah. Yeah. What, man? Just play. All right. Okay, guys. Yeah. Judy. Who are you? Wait. Oh, wait. What? I know, right? Why? I think she's having uh, this take a break or something. How how long are they holding you? <laughs> I know the one. His name is Captain Oak, right? Okay. Uh, do you need me? Okay, good. See you Saturday morning early. Yeah, remember? Okay. So guys, guys, I have to go. I have some urgent work. Oh, oh sorry. Okay. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Later. All this. So wait. You take it from the bench. Yeah, yeah. You take it from the bench. Should we do without it? Oh. Yeah, we have to. Without, yeah. Let's go. Okay. Cool.
had begun so uneventfully, precisely like a hundred evenings before, with Nana putting on the waters for Michael's bath and carrying him to it on her back. Oh, sorry, that won't work. I won't go to bed. I won't, I won't, Nana. It isn't time yet. I shan't love Michael. you anymore, Nana. Michael, hmm? don't forget your medicine. Won't, won't. I know what you want, a hmm? chocolate. Yes. Mother, don't pamper him like that. Michael, when I was your age, I used to take medicine without a mama. I used to say, thank you, dear parents, for giving me bottles to make me feel well. Like hell you did. John, that'll do. We'll do what? That medicine you sometimes take is much nastier, isn't it, Daddy? I was so much nastier, Wendy. In fact, I'll take it as an example for you, Michael. If I lost the bottle. I know where it is, Father. I'll bring it. <laughs> John, it's that most beastly stuff. That nasty, sticky. Sweet kind. It will soon be over. Here it is. You first. You first. I shall be sick. No. Come on, father. Hold your tongue, John. I thought you took it quite easily. That is not the point, Wendy. The point is that there is more in my body than in his spoon, and that is not fair. I am waiting. For oh, God's sake! It's all very well to say that I am waiting. So am I waiting. Father is a cowardly custard. You are a cowardly custard. I'm not frightened. Neither am I frightened. Oh yeah? Well then take it. Well then you take you it. You take it. Why not both take it at the same time? Yes, certainly. Are you ready, Michael? Okay. One, two, three. Oh, oh father. father! What do you oh, mean by oh father? Oh, now stop that now, Michael. I intended to take mine, all right? I just missed it. Oh. What a fucking hypocrite. I'm going to bed. Me That's too. it, me, me. That's it, John. You stay there. How dare you talk to me like that in this house? What did I say? Haven't you been warned before? But why are you shouting this at me? This is your last warning. But why are you shouting at Do me? Do you get it? I don't want to live with you anymore. Are you ready? Oh, yes. Oh. Where is Michael? I have uh, chocolate for you. Uh, they were all gone to bed. Uh, uh, I'll have it. Why not? Did he take his medicine? He most certainly did. I was firm with him. What do the books say? Um, tough laugh! Mm. Tough laugh! Mm. Okay, I'll go and say goodnight to them. Alright. Uh, is Nana staying the night? Yeah, I thought it would be wise, son. Not till you watch him, we'll be back home and all. Wise, I don't know. But probably necessary. Mrs. Darling went to the window. It was securely fastened. She looked out and the night was peppered with stars. They were crowding around the house as if curious to see what was to take place there. She did not notice this, nor did one or two of the smaller ones that winked at her. Yet a nameless fear gripped at her heart and made her cry. Oh, how I wish I wasn't going for the party tonight. You look lovely. Have a great time. Don't worry about it. Thank you, darling. Thank you. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Ready, mother? Uh, we're gonna rock and roll tonight. Oh yeah, we're gonna rock and roll tonight. Yeah. Ready, mother? See? Oh yeah. Please, take him away, please. That yeah, was good, right? And now, 
And now? And now? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bad time, Michael. Yeah. Where's Nana? In the bathtub, soaking. Come, I'll carry you off to dreamland. No, no, no. Will you come with me to dreamland? Uh, I can't come now. But I'll meet you there. Come. And I'm going to listen to all your music there. Promise? Yeah, promise. Good night. Good night. Bye. You are no fun. Come away, come hey, away. Hey, what's going on in here? 
Oh, nothing. Michael is asleep? I suppose so. What have you been smoking? <coughs> Can't fool Nana. Yeah, right. Want a talk? Sure. <laughs> Thank you. Don't mention it. Nighty night. Good night. <laughs> Pirates. Mermaids. Demonstration. Courthouse. Do tomorrow night no 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 yes yeah no uh, black hat are you coming i won't have enough time to come back all right see you there bye hi hey 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 guys hi peter uh, hi man <sighs> you all right yeah sure oh huh? uh 
Peter? Ja, tell me. Think? Yeah. Um, can I talk to you for a sec? Sure. Welcome. Um, we, I mean me and the guys, we were talking our dinner about this girl, you know, Wendy. I thought you had thoughts for her, man. Yeah. Ah. It's not that, Peter. <laughs> Maybe little. Ah. Oh. Oh. But yeah. listen, what yeah. she said. What uh, did she say? About the children and all. What did she say? I was not listening to carefully. No. It makes sense. We can reach so many people with our music, with our songs. We can put a lot of attention on this problem. Yeah. You really have fallen for her, haven't you? It's not like that, Peter. It's not just me. It's all the guys. You all, all want us. to do something. Yeah, man. Why? Yeah. Because it's like she said. If you really come through something like yourself, something like you, Peter, you... Whatever. My pain is my business, okay? And I'm not going to hang it out in public for sneer it and jeer it. Memory will never go away. You know that. I know that. But you helped us. All of us. You gave us a reason to hope. And now what are you doing, Peter? But I gave you a lot of hard work and kicks in the ass too. I know that. Peter, do you remember that day? When you saw me first time? The child who's sitting on the stairs in the rain. He didn't know where to go, where to stay, if he would die. He's just crying. He's just crying. And then you came to me and asked me to come with you. He grabbed your finger just like a big brother and came here. Even for me, Peter. I used to look up to you for inspiration and shit. And now it seems you're all about money, show, business. What happened to you, man? Don't you think we have to give them back? Some way. Somehow. What did he... I was only 12 years old. What would have happened? When I'm on stage today, I feel confident. That's because you made me. Dude, you, you helped me do my homework, finish songs I was too lazy to. You were hard on me when I needed it and always, always dead. I was lost. We all were. But you found us. What are you doing? Peter, when the whole world refused to believe that I can be whatever I want to be, that I can be whatever I want to be, you were that ray of hope, Peter. Why can't we be that ray of hope for all of these children now? I completely agree with them. But Peter, you are the inspiration to all of us. You have taken us where we can't imagine. You, you put out, take out all of our sorrows. And today, you know, we don't remember any childhood descent that, that happened to us. But what happened to us is still happening to someone else. We must help, Peter. We must help. Enough. If you wanna stay with me Courage Here's what you gotta be Courage If you wanna make some changes There's some rules you gotta rearrange Courage It's a world in which there ain't no courage It's a world that really pulls you down if you wanna think of helping others, is it?
If they... show my sorted past there in front of public okay i'm just going to sing that's all look for us on your day let us you <laughs> yeah let's hope we don't get arrested man <laughs> that would be unfortunate <laughs> that's true yeah because the black hat it would be unfortunate because the black hat is completely sold out for our show oh, no! <laughs> 